And a raccoon brought traffic on I-565 to a standstill yesterday, Aaron. And this was for almost half, or almost an hour. It was a multi-regional department affair to rescue this animal and included Huntsville Police, Fire and Rescue, and Animal Control. Also, Animal Wildlife came to the rescue. The raccoon climbed up to the top of the light pole on the side of the interstate and Huntsville Fire sent several people up in a ladder truck there. The raccoon was captured in a net, but rescuers say that raccoon then leapt out of the net before they could bring him safely to the ground. Michael Treat, the director of the Alabama Wildlife Rescue, tells us what happened after the jump. He didn't appear to be that injured at that time. He actually got up and ran across the interstate and we were able to capture him as he was getting to the wall at the edge of the interstate. So it was a pretty quick and dramatic thing. So that raccoon is now being checked out by an emergency vet in the Huntsville area. I know we had several people call about that. It was very interesting. If you watch that video closely, just seeing the raccoon leap. Oh my goodness. But glad it's, it's all okay. 